Hey what's up guys, welcome to Mr. Wick channel once again I'm going out and I would like to share my day with you, obvious Would you like to come with me? Oh, you can't, but it's not a problem. I like to share what I do and where I'm going. And with this lockdown and with the coronavirus, it just can drive us mad. Anyway, I always feel that if I would stay at home, I would eat, I would watch TV and I'd put a lot of weight because that's what you do, is and, and after that, it's hard. I have to lose my weight because the summer is coming. Let's hope this year is going to be a better one. So I would like to do the video and share with you. Stay tuned. Here I am, how about to start my video here by the beautiful house of Toya Wilcox House. Would be nice actually to knock on her door. I reckon she would give me a black eye. She she's start actually to make some videos, would you believe it? Yeah, she does funny videos at home with her husband, what is really nice. And she looks good for her age, I have to say, because I have seen her so many times here in my town. Hope you are all I'm okay. I'm going to show you now some parts of my town once again and share with all of you. And I hope you are all okay. Let's do it together, come on. Life is too short. So there you go. At least the rain just stopped before I left home because it was raining slightly. But at least it stopped, so that is a good thing. My town is really beautiful. It's got a lots of uh, mixture of buildings. Different colors, as you can see it there. Really nice because this is a difficult situation, as I mentioned. And what a better way to come out. Oh my God, this looks a mess here. I don't find them particularly beautiful, unless maybe they will have like some flowers coming in, in April. If it's just this color, mm, I don't know. I think it's too messy for me. Would you like to have something that in your house? I always think this is bad actually for the building himself really strong really strong and you left you need to do a lot of work in your home so your house will need a lot of tlc but hey i respect haha <laughs> 20 miles an hour here what is something really difficult to do that i have to say this is like to go to some towns i have been believe it or not where they where they say you can't do more than 10 miles an hour. So here in my town, some parts of my town, as you can see, is just 20 miles an hour. What is not too bad. And yes, people there can play, I can see. There's a few here, really amazing. Look how big is that? That is what, six double bedrooms, and believe me, all of them with high ceilings. Really stunning, really stunning property. Please use rear entrance door via side path and gate. I will do that, sir. Is that here? <laughs> you must be. And there you go. So here I am. I will help you all out, guys, in this difficult situation. And why not? And why not? It's really hard. I feel strong. I'm determined. I'm positive. I will help you all out. I have even always amazing stories. There's a nice car, a beautiful car, isn't it? The 911, but it's not the turbo. What a beautiful car. Ha <laughs> ha. This beautiful party in my town as well, where he was flooded by here. Look at that, there's a Nissan biker in gold there. And there's another Nissan biker in gold. So one is a 2003. The other is a 2004. Now that is a rarity. I always like to come here and show you a little. So, and it's nice. This is lovely. So if you live here, if you buy a house here, you can have your boat here. Really beautiful. So it's a couple of weeks, can you see there? The water, how much it came? This was all flooded, you couldn't see. Look at that, flooded, as much as there. And here I am sharing my life experience with all of you and i hope you are doing okay if you are not please be strong be positive trying to do with my videos is to spreading the love and the positivity of me to all of you 
So yes, all of this was flooded. But now the water retracts, but I can still see some water. As you can see it there. And I appreciate, so it's good guys, you, you, you go out, you put your mind somewhere else, you have some fresh air, even if it's cold, you know, just take a nice clothes with you, gloves, scarf, whatever, and protect yourself so you feel comfortable. Don't do like me, so many times I went out, even minus one, minus two, actually one day I did minus four without gloves. If you are new to my channel, you're more than welcome, please subscribe. I would be very grateful and I do appreciate guys so you don't lose the next video or you can go even to my channel and see the videos that I got out there and I made already. Very beautiful party of my town. I love to come here. I love to come here. It's really beautiful. And this is the old bridge by the way. They used to use this until the beginnings of 19s and after that obviously they made the road on the right hand side as you can see. You will go there and I'm glad they kept the old bridge here as you can see no cars can go through there. Actually they apparently one day when we were at war we had a, a war tank here actually stationary in case the Germans come and invade us and kill us all but that it never happened so that was a good thing. I don't know if you are aware of this magazine called Forbes and normally once a year it tells you who's the, the richest person in the world. What I want to share with you today is who is the richest animal in the world. You may have heard of Forbes annual rankings of the richest individuals in the world. But I'm going to tell you guys, but what about the richest animals in the world? Maybe you never knew that millionaire animals even existed. Realize actually does exist. Richest and millionaires animals. And I can tell you actually, this animal is a German Shepherd, his name is Gunther IV, the dog inherited this back 1992, but the dog animal with 375 um, million dollars, that is, oh my goodness, that is what, 400 plus million of pounds? Does he have a, a bet made out of gold or something else? Maybe. So yes, the richest dog in the world is a German Shepherd. What is the highest paid dog? The highest paid dog is a dog called Gifbon. He's the top dog. This Pomerian has 9.6 million Instagram followers. Oh my goodness, I think I just reached 14,000 14, uh, uh, followers on, uh, on Instagram. This animal has got nine point. I'm going to ask him if I can have just one million followers in my account. Wow, that is a staggering number. But you know what it does to you because when you have so many followers, it's just going to bring the more followers of you, it's going to bring you more, more money. Because actually, I didn't know you could make a lot of money actually in, on Instagram. And now he earns the most money per Instagram post. Just listen to this, guys, per Instagram post with a potential earnings of up to so $32,000.45 per post on Instagram. That is mind-blowing. I wouldn't mind just have even $32, $32 a post. <laughs> oh, I would be so happy with that. I wish. No, that is a, an achievement. Wow, oh my goodness. But, you know, if you can see that he does have a lot of followers, isn't it? 9.6 is a lot of... It's a big number, huge number actually, huge number. Oh my goodness. So yes, let's appreciate here. Beautiful here, yeah. In this bridge actually, some parts of this bridge, as you can, you can't see from here, but along the way actually, they still got some holes from the bullets because when there was a war here, I don't know if he was uh, between two different counties in the 18 something. And yeah, a friend of mine actually told me there's marks of the bullets along the way of this old bridge. It was renovated and they reinforced it last year, so that is nice. As you can see on the other side is the new, the new bridge. Who is the world's richest cat? Ha <laughs> ha! 
You must be thinking, even a cat? <laughs> I start to think there's riches, snakes, even ants, a beetle, a bird, eagle. I wonder if there's the, who's the richest seagull in the world? Oh, that is another project for me. No, I'm interested in that, guys. I would love to see it. So the richest cat is a cat called Blackie, considered the richest cat by Guinness World Records until 2019. This cat actually inherits a 12.5 million fortune. Oh my goodness, are you having a laugh, Blackie? Bla I do like cats. I wonder if the cat wants to live with me so I can use the money. I can buy some stuff for me. And for the cat, obviously, I would have to bring the cat with me. I reckon I would be very popular. Isn't these things ama amazing that I, I found out? It does surprise me, you see. I do like to know about these things. What are you going to uh, find out? The stories, this, etc. What an amazing story about the dog, the most richest dog in the world, and the cat as well. Isn't that incredible? Hope you are all okay. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for watching. Very grateful. Hope you are okay. And I hope to see you next time. God bless you all. And I hope to see you sometimes, guys. Bye-bye for now. Hey!